So by mistake, you have deleted your Facebook ad campaign and you are now in a panic mode. I can totally understand your situation because I was in a similar situation a few years ago where I, you know, by mistake, uh, deleted my client's uh, Facebook ad campaign and I was panicking like hell. So I'll tell you how you can recover your deleted Facebook ad campaigns uh, within just a few steps and you do not need to panic right now. You can recover those campaigns. Uh, usually how it happens is that you want to delete one campaign but you have you know by mistakenly selected other campaigns also and all of them get deleted but they are there in the system you do not need to panic how you can recover those campaigns let's look at uh, that right away so there are basically two ways to do it uh, one of the way is uh, let's say you have this campaign i've just cre uh, created a duplicate campaign of this one and I am going to select this one and I am going to delete this campaign. Okay. So here I have deleted the campaign and this is where you, you know, uh, start panicking. That campaign is now, I'm not able to see the campaign anywhere, but there's a way to find that campaign. You go to search and you come to the section delivery and click on campaign delivery and then select deleted and then apply. Okay, so it'll show you all the deleted campaigns here. Uh, this is one of the latest one which I've deleted. Uh, you have seen that copy. So I am going to select this campaign. Then I'm going to go to ad set. I'm going to select the ad set also, but ad set also it is not showing. So I will go to search bar again, come to ad set delivery as deleted and click on apply. It will show me the ad set as well. So I'll click on ad set after that i'll go to add also because we want to recover all uh, all the three campaigns ad sets and ads and then uh, for add also we will go and do the same ad delivery is deleted and apply okay so here is the ad okay so all of these uh, we want to uh, recover them so for that you can just directly go and click on duplicate and click on duplicate and duplicate the, um, all these three things and uh, publish after that uh, this is one of the way but sometimes this also does not work uh, what i like to do is i click on this icon here if you see after the delete option there's this icon uh, this is export and import icon i export all the selected okay and export it into excel or csv i'll just click on csv and export it okay so this is what I like to do and I'll just click and open the file. Okay, so this is the campaign, uh, you know, which is right now if it shows campaign status is archive or uh, you might see it as deleted. Okay, what we want to do it as we want to put the status as paused, P-A-U-S-E-D, paused as well. Paused or active, you can put active also, but we don't want the campaign to go active as soon as we you know uh, publish uh, this sheet uh, we want to keep it paused so campaign status is paused paused okay so this is paused oh, one is active we'll see uh, we'll keep it as paused also you also want to make sure that you delete the ids also so add id both the add ID. it is going to create the ids from you know uh, from scratch so let's delete campaign IDs also and let us delete uh, ad ID. and I will also delete uh, you know one of the campaigns so if you see these are uh, the two campaigns of the same name uh, I'm not sure why it has given two campaigns here I'll just delete one of them and just keep only one because that's the one we have deleted and that's the one we want to recover so after that and then come back to the section come to uh, export and import section click on ads choose the file is the file open import okay so it says there is a error ad was imported but some issues are there yes let's click and uh, if I just click on review and publish see uh, so this is just a warning let's publish it okay 
and then you just want to remove all the filters now and come to the campaign section that's it yeah so if you see uh, we have recovered uh, the campaign now it's paused it's in the pause status which is what we have changed it to and uh, if we click on uh, you know other uh, campaign uh, here is the ad set if we click on the ad set here is the ad so we have uh, you know successfully recovered the whole campaign likewise you can do it for others also as i said you can either directly uh, duplicate the campaign but duplication you know sometimes it gives a lot of errors for me it gave a lot of errors but if you do it with the export and import way you know uh, that way actually uh, it might not give you much of errors and you will be able to successfully uh, you know uh, duplicate this campaign or uh, recover this campaign so that's how you recover a facebook ad campaign uh, if you like this video uh, do check out my other videos uh, you know subscribe to the channel like this video give a thumbs up and i'll meet you in the next video very soon thank you so much bye